Yeah, yeah who's in all? Get that ZQ on Yeah, yeah. ZQ on the ground. Then you yeah, I was going to get that. You can't. You can't. That was the piece of it. Alright, this is a ZQ3. Alright. I think you should go. This is ZQ3, and this is my name. I'm going to This is all my ZQ, but you're going to do it. This is a ZQ uh, 30. Uh, yeah, yeah, 30. Uh, you know, 30. Uh, ZQ3. Go to Psalm 9. That's cool. Oh, oh, ZQ9 and Ezekiel 9 and 4. And the Lord said unto him, Go through the midst of the city, through the midst of Jerusalem, and set a mark upon the foreheads of the men that sigh and that cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. You know what some guys are not sighing and crying, man? You know, you're happy with this car and so and the fan new, fan new seven man saying you got to build you, saying you got to build church. What a different kind of asshole. Where in the Bible did they say to you? Huh? Did the house have more than you? Do you need that man? It's a preach the word man. We instant in season and out season. That's it. It's simple man. That's why a lot of guys are growing up. You lose the power, man. Because you, you, you're trying to do all these crazy things, man. And it's just simple. Just go out there and preach the word. That's it. It might be boring, because you feel like you're doing the same thing each week. Well, and, and, and if you're you of the elect, it's not going to be boring. Because the scriptures say um, you, um, you're lukewarm. You're going to be up and up. The scripture says, your lamps keep your lamps burning. So you gotta be, you gotta be in the spirit, man. You understand? Said put up with your lamp on the forehead and the men. Man or woman, this is the this is the time of women. That's why I said for the men that are saying crap. They ain't saying nothing about signing of any woman. Ain't no woman signing of crying, man. But this society is something for them. That's why we say a woman shall compass a man. But they're not sad and crying. They're living luxuriously with their family. And, and, and they're gonna they're gonna perish, man. Don't get me wrong, if you have some sisters, I was watching a video uh, last night, man, of a sister. She, it's, it's called um worthless Israelite woman. And this black woman, the Israelite woman, she's basically going into the scriptures. You can, you can, this is like, and I, and I, I respect her, I ain't gonna lie, I respect her. The first one, the first one I was watching, I was, I was looking at freaking man. I was just feeling like, I was just feeling like, they should have been doing that a long time ago. I look at the girl, I look at the girl, I hear the black woman, doing something that she should. She's feeling something that she got nice. Yo, man, man, don't worry, man, don't worry. Yeah. Don't worry. You know that like you're charged up, man. Keep like ready. Don't worry, man. Jezebel, she's in that feminist, that Jezebel feminist spirit. You know, oh, he, he, he's he got to speak nice to me. You know, she's in that Jezebel, because uh, she even said that through women, sin came into the world. She even admitted it right there on the screen. She even came, and they're, they're, they're for it, man. They're, they're down for it. And there was other sisters in the background saying, yep, yeah, it's true. So you do have sisters out there that are right, man. Believe it or not. They don't have this, that, that, that demonic, Feminist Jezebel spirit, they don't have mm. that spirit, man. Mm. But certain sisters that don't have that spirit, man. Well, the Lord might have So, you know, so, 
who have sisters that are gonna be delivered. I mean, it's, it's hard to believe, but it's, it's hard to believe. And they don't have that, that feminist women stand up against male aggression or that crap, man. You got certain sisters that have the spirit of, you know, really that the spirit of the most high, man. You know, they don't have a problem with the order and the standard that the most high set up, man. Because if you go against, if you rebel against that, that, that order, that's the sin of witchcraft, man. That's idolatry. You know? And you are going to die to death. chapter 2 verse 20 it says notwithstanding I have a few things against thee because thou sufferest that woman Jezebel which call of herself a prophetess yeah, that's what this, this fucking black woman you are these fucking black women trying to put themselves in a position of authority man to be teaching men the last time a woman taught man in the beginning that's when wickedness came into the world man because she thought that she could sit up there and tell a man where he is, the order of things, man. Where? So like here, Jezebel which called herself a prophetess to teach and to seduce my servants, to commit fornication, and to eat things sacrificed unto idols. Exactly, and that's what the black woman is basically doing when they teach. And, it, and this is the scripture that the sister brought out on that video. Okay. On a, this is that a worthless angel that woman. I was, I, I was watching one of the hardest videos on um, what is the 666 mark and I saw that uh, on the side I saw one of the videos worth his head and I thought I was like, I'll do this thing is taking that mark off and now it happened I, I, I thought I was going to watch the whole thing but I went and watched the whole half an hour and it was on point and um, she, she brought out this scripture basically you know what I'm saying you got black women out there trying to teach black men about you know, okay. I come first, basically. They got this I come first spirit. That's idolatry. You don't come first. That's not the order of the most high. But you know the what, man? What we gotta do, man, is we gotta be smart with the guy. We gotta be fucked. You know what I'm saying? She ain't no big deal. She ain't no big deal. You're just playing her part. Her part, her part is the... Because it tells you in Micah, the seventh chapter, that my, uh, she that is my enemy shall see it. So, you know what I mean? It's already, it's already fulfilled to happen that she's going to do things against her father and against the initial like that, you know? So the hell is black. You know what I'm saying? That's just a lot to say. Uh, yeah, um, I'm going to continue on though. It says, Revelations 2, verse 21, And I gave her space to repent of her fornication, and she repented not. Well, ho, I will cast her into a bed and them that commit adultery with her into great tribulation, except they repent of their deeds. And I will kill her children with death, and all the churches shall know that I am he which searcheth the reins and heart, and will give unto every one of you according to your works. But unto you, I say, and unto the rest in Thyatira, Thyatira, if I'm saying it correctly. As many as I have not this, as as many so like that which have not this, not this doctrine, and which have not known the death of Satan, as they speak, I will put upon you none other burden. But that which you have already, hold fast until I come. And it says, and he that overcometh, keeping my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations. And he shall rule them with a rod of iron, as the vessels of a potter shop that he drove into sugar. That's, that's what we're waiting for. Right? Um, we 
is it? Or is it going to happen? Habakkuk 2, verse 3, it says, For the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it, because it will surely come, and it will not tarry. Exactly, so taking this time, man. It's, you know, the thing, the things that we've been speaking of, that our elders have been speaking of for such a long time, for decades, I feel like a tarry, but it is coming, man. It is coming. And really what you have to do as well is, is you know, because, I mean, a lot of the times, like, you may feel as though it's not, nothing's happening, but what you got to do is, is, is keep it with what's going on, and you will see that. That's, that's part of the most ass test as well, like, yeah. when the, nothing's happening, that's probably the most ass test. Right. We're still, right. we're still, the nigga only want to get hyped up when something's happening. He, he's not faithful, man. Most of testing your faithfulness, man. Because, you know, you want your woman to be faithful to you, innit? How the hell can you expect your woman to be faithful? You're not faithful to the man. You know? yeah. And so, so it says, for um, well, the vision is yet for an appointed time. But at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it, because it will surely come. It will not tarry. Behold, his soul which is lifted up is not upright in him. But the just shall live by the faith, by his faith. Exactly. You know the soul. Because we're, we're, we're trying to be upright. But we're ruled by a man that is not upright. And as the scripture says, you know, the righteous. Wicked bearer, you know, righteous or uh, holy. Proverbs 29 of Proverbs uh, 29. You know, my kid. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn. Exactly. So we're mourning, we're sighing and crying, man, for all the abominations. And that's why I say the just shall live by faith. You know, we walk by, we walk by faith like our God. And this wicked man, this carnal man, this man, this and if we have faith that what that what what, what is what is our the elements of our faith? What comprises our faith? The ending of, of his power structure, the incoming of the time of tribulation, alright, the, the, the complete desolation of his society, the death of the two-thirds of our nation, alright? The salvation of our Lord, man, when he calls in all his glory, man. And the establishment of his kingdom on this earth. Alright? So that's 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 the um that's the nature of our faith, man. That's it. This is the last thing, wasn't it? 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 Hebrews 10 verse 38. So it says, this is Hebrews 10 verse 30, uh, yeah, 37. It says, for yet a little while, and he that shall come will come, and will not tarry. Now the just shall live by faith. But if any man draw back, our soul shall not have no pleasure in him. First 
and so shall have no delight in them. So, so what guys, what guys do back? Go over here, what guys the GMS are doing back? And fill out the place. They lost patience. They lost patience, man. This is my favorite one. This is the main scripture that I like the most. Nine, verse 62. And the Howard Shai said unto him, No man, having put his hand to the plow, and looking back, is fit for the kingdom of the Most High. And also, you know, that's why I told that new that new the brother that I was talking about. I told him, you know, God, to be coming this tree bed is pretty self out of this is way here. Before you enter in, so if you enter in, there's no going back. And if you go back, that's your horse now. Most of the feet you can make straps. I think I'm going to be there again on the people's turn. Yeah, guys. It's turn. Verse 38. Now, the just shall live by faith. But if any man draw back, my soul shall have no pleasure in him. For we are not of them. Draw back onto perdition. Yeah, exactly. So that's a, that's a statement saying we ain't we ain't one of the niggas. We ain't losers, man. We don't we don't go back. We we know what we're doing. We know what we're about.